Thanks to EA for sponsoring today's vlog. Whoa! You would not believe it, Rocket Arena is now available and it has crossplay. It's a third person multiplayer shooter that you guys can download for Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and PC. Rocket Arena has four competitive PvP modes and one PvE mode with a ranked mode. It has 10 maps and tons of fun characters. Season number one of Rocket Arena is going to be launching very soon with tons of awesome free stuff for you guys. There will be a brand new hero, tons of unlockable outfits, rocket fuel rewards, and a lot more cool stuff that you'll definitely want to see. The live service session will be updated regularly. So master the rocket, jump in, and rocket everything. Thank you, EA, for sponsoring today's video. Look at the stars. Wow. You know what would be really cool? If one day we go to another planet. Yes. But you see, James, you're getting there. How do you get to another planet? By traveling. With a rocket. Oh! <laughs> oh you see where I'm going with this? Yeah. We're going to another planet? We can't really oh, fit on that though. To another planet. We might not go to another planet, but we can see who can make the coolest rocket. <laughs> <laughs> Who can make the coolest <laughs> rocket? <laughs> Who can make the highest flying rocket? This is a competition, and the winner will win thousands of dollars. Well, here, I got one. No, that's my rocket. That's my... I'm going to hey, the moon. It's got fins. It's a fish, then. Oh, the rockets are just flying fish. What did you just say? Huh? You All said right. what did you just say? Oh, I said rockets are just flying fish. You said fish are just flying rockets. This is enough nonsense. Roll the video. The competition begins. My name is Nathan, I also go by Unspeakable, and my goal to win this challenge is to build a really tall rocket like this. Boop, 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 da -da -da -da. It's not really stable right now, so it just kind of, you know, falls, falls apart, but you see, my theory, <laughs> my theory to this is if I build a really tall rocket, it's gonna go really high because it's tall. See where I'm going with this? Big brain. Big because brain. if you think about it, if my rocket flies the same distance that James's rocket does, but mine is two feet taller, I win. I'm not sure that it works the same way. So I'm Gabe, as most of you guys know. So my goal is to build a rocket. No way! <laughs> That was just rude. All right, you know, I want to say I'm going to have the best rocket because I feel like his is not going to work at all. What are these? Because of the engines. <laughs> and, but, like, I'm reading these instructions, and I'm just super confused. Like, look at this. Rocket science. Oh, wait, I just figured it out. Yeah, I'm going to have the best rocket. Better than everyone here. Because, like, I'm I reading the instructions. Shh. Where's Kane go? Interruption. But, yeah, I'm going to have the best one around. Mine's going to go the fastest. I, I can say that. supposed to super glue the, the metal pole to the rocket, right? No. I thought you were. I got super glue all over and it and the rocket. And how does it go launch? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> with that, I guess, it's coming with it. Ah, I got super glue on my finger. <laughs> Even though your rocket's the tallest one, it's not gonna go anywhere. Shut up. I love super glue. No, I super glued it and it was the wrong. Loser. Starting Stop. to look like a rocket, doesn't it? Doesn't it look like a rocket? It looks like a stick. Come on, a mid eight. We all know what it looks like. It looks like, like crap. Oh, well, that's just rude. Okay, got my final fin on and the rocket is complete. Not really, we just only the parachute. You don't even have the top on. What is this? You have Q-tips on your rocket. Oh, oh my gosh, it's super glued to the rocket. Yo, chill. Keep your stuff on your side. That's why I'm wearing gloves. I hate super glue. But if you get super glue on your gloves, doesn't that just stick to it? Yeah, I mean, it's still like really difficult to work with, but at least I don't get super glue hands. Fun facts. Fruit snacks. That Extra part. Fun. Oh, wait. Actually, I need that. This is my parachute. It's your umbrella. All right, let's see here. Gonna decorate my rocket. I'm mm, gonna have to throw a little bit of green. Maybe some blue. We need a counter color. Let's do roar. Let's begin. First, we're gonna start with a squiggly line from the top all the way to. Oh, I stopped. Oh, it works. To the I'm other top. And now we flip it. Wow, it actually works. Let me, let me try mine. Let me try mine. Ready? 
it actually works. No! I'm disappointed that it actually works. Same, I thought it wasn't let even me give together, it another, but it Let me was. give it another try, another try. Here, let me <laughs> try, let me try. Okay, it didn't work. I should have folded right, it. what do I first. do with that thing? Double. Don't tell me what, what, what I want. Mm -hmm. it. Put it off like a... Are you secretly trying to hit me right now? Stop, <laughs> that's sketchy. Do it to Gabe. Knowing you're lucky, it's gonna hit it's, you in the face. Yeah, it's gonna hit me in the eye. That's the whole point. I like seeing. Okay, so here is the deal. I need you guys to watch till the end of the video because in this video, we will also be launching these rockets, of course. So watch till the end to see what happens because uh, let me tell you, oh. this boy is going to the moon. Okay, I think my rocket is done. Let me double check my instructions here. Yeah, it's done. It's really fun. Tiny. Yeah, it is pretty small. But hey, what if it goes like two million feet in the air? Two million? I exaggerated a little bit. But it's gonna go high. I have faith. What is that? I'm decorating my rocket. It's a soda bottle? Anyway, I'm waiting for my parachute to dry so my rocket can safely land back where it took off. Why is your parachute wet? Why are you blowing on the rocket and not the parachute if your parachute's wet? Is a UFO a rocket then? Okay. Serious question. No. Why not? A UFO is an unidentified flying object. But we know what it is. No, you don't. We know it's a UFO. You label an unidentifiable object as unidentifiable. You label a rocket as a rocket because you know what a rocket is. Does UFO stand for unidentifiable object? Flying. Got the flying. Yeah, unidentifiable flying object. Wow. The test the first rocket. This right here is our warm-up rocket. Before we play with the big guns, we gotta test this boy out. So this is a simple water bottle rocket. Also, I wanna thank EA for sponsoring today's video. This right here is our TNT pump. Oh! Just like that. Oh! <laughs> it's on the roof. I didn't even get to watch it. I was looking at the ground. I was looking at the PSI that this pump said. All right, we found the rocket. It came back down from Mars, and we're gonna give it another try. Oh! Already. Wow. I don't know where it went. It's right behind us. And right. Oh. <laughs> Yo, I keep missing it. Why? So, our little device here should have told us how high it went. But it didn't, because we don't know how to work it. Flight one, altitude, zero feet. Top speed, 15 miles per hour. We got the fruit punch rocket. Weighing in at only 50 calories and a lot of sugar, it's gonna fly. Red versus green. All right. Red unspeakable shirt. Red rocket versus green Gabe with the green pump. I'm not sure how <laughs> I feel about your blue shoes with the blue bowl over there. And the blue Blue sky. I think this is red versus green versus blue. Okay, I'm gonna launch it. Give me launch it. All right, yeah, go for it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Pump harder. Go fast, fast, fast. Go, go, go. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, oh. oh, my. Hey, that thing's pretty good. <laughs> it landed right behind us. Altitude 51 feet, supposedly. Is that, that smoke one. inside of it? It's water vapor. It's like a lot of smoke I'm inside of it. It's like a real rock. rock. Flight one, altitude 51 feet. Top speed 113 miles per hour. 113 miles per hour. It launched quick. Zoom! <laughs> Peak acceleration, 22.6 G's. G forces. Wait, 22 G's? Yeah, that's what it said. 22 G's? I'm pretty sure that's enough to like kill someone. Yeah, I think like trained pilots, like fighter jet pilots. They can't go over 10, yeah, I think. Eight's like, kind of like yeah, eight's like a respectable number. Yeah. That, that was actually kind of cool. This is my rocket. I call it the TNT. Now this is just the beginning of its design. I'm gonna make this whole thing look like a planet. Mars is gonna be up here. The sun's gonna be over here. We're gonna have stars. It's gonna be sick. So I have my rocket here. It's built. It's hydro dip it. Save the explanation. I don't think anyone has actually hydro dipped a rocket before. Woo! We can hydro dip this fish. Bom, 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 bom. See, most rockets are supposed to go up like. But this one's gonna go straight down into no, the no, ocean. No, 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 Like this. You stepped up. Oh! Yo, hydro dip the fish. Wait, hold uh, on, I'm putting a lot of work in this. It's too late for the fish. Looks it's nice. Just pink now. <laughs> now it's a salmon. Pink salmon. It smells like spray paint. Have you clicked the subscribe button yet? Because the subscribe button is red like my I'm shirt. Dipping it. And if you we'll haven't clicked it yet, then we'll never hydro dip ever again. Go for it. Surface tension. Ooh, why is it so satisfying? Why are you only getting three colors? 
Whoa! Oh, I pulled it up. I forget you gotta dip it back in, like all the way, but I didn't oh, want to get the cardboard oh, like. You're messing Yo, it up. Yo, look at it! What on is point. that? It's got a booger coming off the top. Yeah, that turned out terrible. <laughs> <laughs> that turned out absolutely terrible. Well, you know, I don't think I got the cardboard wet. I'll fix this, I'll fix this. Can I dip mine? What are you making? A oh, rocket ship! Purple, yellow, purple, yellow, purple. <laughs> that looks beautiful. Don't. Don't you do it. But look at him, he's so cute. No, 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 what are you doing? I kind of liked yours more than mine. Yeah, it looks nice, what do you think? <sighs> looks like a loogie. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, pull him out, he looks cool now. Yo! Yo! Oh, look at that hey, take of him. paint. Take him, he's oh, yours. No. He's Stop. yours. Stop, Stop it. Put him in there. Stop it. Right meow. Stop. <laughs> Back to square. Oh, okay. Again, but this time I won't destroy it. Why do we always say we're gonna wear gloves next time we do this, but we never wear gloves? Rocket's going in. You got the engine wet. How dare you? Yeah, the engine is definitely wet. All right, now swirl your hands so you can get all the all the crap off of it. Coming in to save the day. Get it all off. All right, it's coming out. Here comes the rocket. Oh, oh. no, it's cooler. The rocket or your hands? My hands look great. <laughs> all right, so we're going to let these dry. And next thing you know, we're launching them to space. So we're here. First rocket we're launching is the one I made. Gabe's rocket. Okay, let's do it. Any last words, Gabe, before we launch your rocket into and space? And lose it forever. I don't yeah. care where you go. Just fly. I don't even know free. if this thing's gonna work. Yes. Three, two, one, go! Did you press it? Ah! There it Whoa! goes! Yo! Ah! Ah! Work. Go catch it! Yes. Go catch it! I'm going! Ah! Catch it! Yo! Yo, I, I was think. not expecting that. He pressed the button, didn't work. Press it again, didn't work. It took like five <laughs> tries. You have information. I was only expecting it to go like 15 feet. That went like 200 feet. How high? 198 feet! 198 feet. Top speed, 114 miles per hour. Last time I ever went that fast was in my car. That did not go as high as advertised. It's at a thousand. Maybe it was a different rocket, I don't know. Okay, so the TNT rocket, my rocket, is on the launch site right now. I really hope it goes higher than 198 feet. Good. I'm going for the big bucks, boys. Mine was the smallest go. rocket. I so. think I can do it. We gotta put the key into the detonator, and we are ready. In three, well, two, Ten, one. Right. Oh! Oh! Go after it. Go right. Oh, go right. Oh. Go right. Oh, oh there's oh, a, that's a six right, second straight, delay. Straight. Oh, catch it. He's gonna catch it. Catch it. Oh, no. oh I got it. Oh, it. I got it. He, he it bounced off the ground he, and then he, he cut got the parachute. Did you catch yours? He caught his, dude. You yeah, 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 yeah. 192 feet. Yeah. 68 miles per hour. I think my rocket was kind of heavy. Yeah, yours went pretty slow, but it was really cool watching it go up slow. Dude, you could see it perfectly going up the sky. 4.5 Gs of acceleration. That's like a roller coaster. We got James's rocket on the launch pad, ready to take flight. Now, this is in between the size of my rocket and the size of Nathan's rocket. So it's about a medium size the rocket compared to all the ones we're launching today. But James, whenever you're ready, ready I just go. recommend the viewers put on some sunglasses because we're going to the sun. I'm gonna hit the sun with this rocket. The camera has a filter on it. Don't look at the sun. It has its own sunglasses. Put in that key on the detonator. Three, two, one. Hold it, push it, come on. There's a piece He's that going. fell off to the right of the rocket. Oh yeah, there is a piece that what came off that? the rocket. It might have been a fin, maybe. Yeah! Oh, he caught it! He caught the rocket! I got it. Moment of truth. Let's see who got the highest altitude so far. Gabe is winning. I'm in last place right now. That was the best rocket launch. Gabe in first place with 198 feet. I'm in second place with 192 feet, and James coming in at... So it's funny, because you're supposed to put a certain piece of paper inside the rocket. I put the instruction manual. That's why I went the highest. 176 feet. Weak 176 sauce. feet yeah. for James. That means Gabe oh. is our winner! Yeah, little rocket for the win. You know, I lost this one fair and square. I'm not going to say no one cheated, but I was robbed. So we have Gabe as our winner of the I'm rocket winner. competition. Six Compet feet? Six feet? Competition. Competition. Yeah, I'm sorry, James. It it looked like it went a little Your instruction more manual, you should have took it out of the rocket. It kind of burnt to crisp. The way it was launched, yeah. I just feel like it, I don't know, just gracefully. It, it was beautiful. It was all about the site, not the position <laughs> and the spot of winning. Well, Gabe is our winner, but we still have more rockets that we're going to launch right now, like we'll the hydro dipped again. one. Bigger and engine. I want to launch mine again to see if we can get even higher. Maybe I'll put a bigger engine in it. Let's begin with the hydro dipped rocket. All right, we got the hydro dipped rocket. I am excited to see if this thing works, considering I dipped this rocket completely underwater. So if this rocket works, I will be highly surprised, but here we go. I'm putting in the key. We're ready to launch. Three, two, 
One. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna work. Um, it is a dead boy. It is a uh, faulty not... battery. Just switch it out and we'll try a different one. The rocket ship's still good. Brand new engine in the hydro dip rocket because the other one was well, uh, underwater. Because the, and it was, no, it wasn't it backwards. Was, it was, I think it was backwards. All right, here we go. Water. Three, Darkest engine we got. two, one. Oh, snap. Oh, that went, that oh went my really high. Oh my gosh. The parachute's it's, not, there oh, it, is. it did open, it did open. Oh, that's a crash. That's a hard crash. <laughs> Dude, <it's real. laughs> Yo, it smells like the 4th of July. Oh my here. gosh. Yo, 335 feet. And the rocket is bit, it. as you can see. 142 miles per hour, and it took 1.9 seconds. Wait, how fast? 142 miles per hour. <laughs> my car can't even go that fast. Peak acceleration, <laughs> eight Gs. Eight Gs. The strength is eight games. So, you know, that last rocket went higher than the previous record, which was held by me. This rocket's a little bit smaller than the one that has the record, but it has the same engine, same strength of an engine in there. So hopefully it should go higher. All right, let's, let's see if this rocket can beat 335 feet. Key in the ignition. I don't want to look. Ow! Oh my, <laughs> what happened? <laughs> The one time I didn't look. Wait, wait, wait. Come, on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, there it goes, parachute. What, what happened? It sh it went straight up and it was like, <laughs> <laughs> it went straight up and then went straight down. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'll tell you, that thing definitely got some G's though. 11.8 G's. What could have gone wrong? Uh, probably because we used it already. So much power. So oh, power, baby. What happened here? The rocket looks okay. Are you carrying my rocket away from me? Yeah. It just had the you hardest day of its life. Rocket. And you're going to take it away from its owner? It was 11.8 G's. Yeah. Oh, that was Ooh. Probably the impact of hitting the crown. 143 feet, almost higher than James's. There's no way. It went, did it really go that high? Dude, there's no way. 213 miles per hour. Yeah, on the way down. <laughs> and that's what happens when you put a too powerful engine and a really poorly made rocket. I made it without the instructions. This is our last wow. rocket, and this one I'm so really hot. curious to see how this is gonna work because this one's like a snake. It's literally called the Wiggly Snake. Wacky Wiggler. Wacky so Wiggler. The rocket is in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different pieces that Can't aren't even tip, connected. Dude. It's Six, supposed to like break seven, apart eight, and be nine, like, kind of like it's a actually slinky. Actually, twelve. Twelve different pieces. Twelve different pieces that are just not even connected. I say when we detail. launch, we run away from it. Yeah. Yeah. I, no, I, I agree. After that last one, I will be over there. We're gonna die. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Dude, the rocket's literally curved. Towards us, too. Oh, 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 oh it's on the roof, it's on the roof, it's on the roof. On the roof. Um, so how do we get that? I mean, that's a pretty steady roof. All right, we're gonna figure out how to get up there. It is time to cool off <laughs> the video. Send it, James. Just All right, ready? I'm just gonna pump it as fast as go, I can. Go, 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 go. Pump, 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 pump. Oh, oh there, <laughs> wow, that went pretty high. <laughs> that was actually better than I thought Yo, it would be. we watered the grass. Yeah. <laughs> and our altitude is 1,000 feet. Oh, Dude, no way. Yeah. What? what? <laughs> Some water. Thank you guys for watching this video and thank you for EA for sponsoring today's vlog. Until then, we'll see you next time. No way! Okay. <laughs>